In this shoemaking tutorial, I will reveal the secrets of this shoemaking tool, measurement tape. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel and click the bell button to be notified when my new video will come out. Learn how to make shoes with my step-by-step -step video courses. So in shoe making, we use this special measurement tape. It's very important tool when we start making shoes because working with this tape, we can find all anatomical lines that will define the correctness and beauty of your shoes. We measure the joint line and with joint line, we can find the right place for the throat line, the instep the length of our throat line, how we can open it, the back of the height of the back. So there are a lot of other different important lines that we must measure and find working with this shoemaking tape. And if you are working without measuring and finding all important anatomical lines and design your shoes by your eyes, you will have not comfortable shoes and also not beautiful shoes. Why we use this shoemaking tape? First of all, it's very flexible and it's very easy to measure it working with curves of our shoe last tape, shoe last, you see? It's curved surface, so it's very flexible and narrow tape that's working with this tape, it's very easy to do so. If you will compare it with ordinary measurement tape that we use in clothing, it's not such a flexible, it's wider than the shoemaking tape, and it's very, um, not, not uh, very, but hard to measure certain measurements working with this ordinary measurement tape. In this shoemaking measurement tape, we have three different measurement systems. The metrical systems, centimeters. On the other side, we have other important measurements that can tell us what is the size of your shoe last. We have here European system of measurements, sizes, for example, you see 37, 38, and so on. And also we have here English system of um, shoe size measurement, you see here. So if you don't have any table of measurements, you can use this tape and understand what is the size of your shoe last. Let's see how we do it. To define the shoe last size, we need to measure the length of our shoe last. We can measure it working with the side of the tape and it gives us the length in metrical system of measurements. For example, the length of this shoe last, we need to place it correctly, is 25 and four. Okay, but if I want to know what is the shoe last size in European system of measurement or English system of measurement, you need to turn it over and measure it working with this side of the tape. And you see the number of the shoe last size of this, uh, the size of, uh, and then to know what is the shoe last size in European system of measurement or in English system of measurement, turn over this measurement tape and measure the length of the shoe last in using this side of the shoe of this tape. So you see the shoe last size is 38 in European system of measurement and in English system of measurement it, it is five, okay? So and so on, you see size 36, uh, 36, it's almost three and a half in English system of measurement. And if you will turn it over, 36 in, in metric system of measurement, metrical system of measurement is 24 centimeters, okay? 
This is how you can work with this shoemaking tape, very easy and precise to measure different anatomical lines and to know what is the shoe last size in different system of measurements. That's it. Thank you for watching. And of course, don't forget to subscribe to this channel and click the bell button to be notified when my new video will come out. Thank you and see you in the next video. Bye.